Hi, so I'm a psychic medium. I have been for like 10 years now. Um, in light of Mac Miller's death, who's... I didn't listen to his music. Uh, I think I would did now. It's freaking awesome. Um, being a psychic medium, what happens is I'll think of someone, a celebrity who died, and a lot of the time they'll come to me and um, we'll go back and forth with sending images and stuff. Um, as soon as I thought of Mac Miller, it was like a th three or four days after he died, and um, I feel his energy around me, and uh, he, he seems very aware as a spirit, um, even out of his body. He seems to be to be very um, approachable. It seems. Um, I just wanted to bring up some things that happened. Um, mainly, just one thing actually. Um, when we were communicating, he had uh, used lyrics from a song, Incubus' a song, originally Pink Floyd's song, I Wish You Were Here. And he centered on, and in this moment, I am happy. And I think that if he knew I was going to make a video about him, which I, I think this is the first time I've ever done that for a celebrity, um, he would have uh, wanted me to bring up what he was feeling in general. So I think that's a message to more like the world in general and not anyone in, in specifically. So I, I did look up the lyrics to uh, Incubus and whatever. And yeah, I was surprised that he would have chosen a song, I Wish You Were Here, instead of like, I Wish I Was Back Alive. No, it's the opposite. He wishes, I guess he sees the other side as better and um, says, yeah, I Wish You Were Here instead. Which is a little bit, you know, sort of shocking or surprising. And I looked up uh, Max Malcolm's birthday, January 19th. He's a Capricorn. And it says, The intelligence of Capricorns born on the 19th is rooted in an awareness of their psychic understanding. They recognize the connection between conscious and unconscious thought, which comes together in dreams and creativity. They can present themselves in many different guises, but their true nature may not resemble any of them. That, to me, has his energy on point, because as soon as I feel like I connected with him, I felt like he was very aware. A lot. Of, sometimes when you connect to a spirit, you can kind of get a sense of how aware they are, or how smart they are, or how definitely how bubbly they are. If they're, like, female and, like, blonde, you'll, you'll get a sense that they're all, like, bubbly. But uh, he seems very, like, awake and aware right off the bat. But, yeah, I guess I just wanted to say that if there was a song that he wanted to pass on to the world, it's I Wish You Were Here. And uh, a little surprising uh, to me. I thought I had heard him say that he, like the reason for his death, I didn't ask why or how. I didn't, uh, well, I asked how, like I asked which drug and um, didn't really get anything back because I, I just, I, I assumed it was like codeine or drink or whatever and um what was i saying yeah the the general like reason of why he went i'm pretty sure that what he said to me was um self-centeredness and being a capricorn the very very hard working the they have a big vision big dreams and him coming out with an album called The Divine Feminine goes hand in hand with what this is saying for January 19th Capricorns, which is rooted in an awareness of their psychic understanding. They recognize the connection between conscious and unconscious thought. So he was definitely um, deep into his own mind and understanding of his reality and everything. I know that much. Um, four and a half minutes. All right, I guess I'm going to end this video, but to me... I don't. I didn't know Mac Miller. I didn't listen to his music. I think it's awesome though. His main message to the world, I think, would be, um, "I wish you were here." So go listen to that song. A lot of the times, they only communicate with lyrics or with movie clips with me. Um, as soon as I thought about making this video, my whole body went freezing. I mean, it's a little bit colder today, but I was warm right up until I thought about making this video like from internally my body just started like shivering and I'm freezing cold 
So uh, that's why I'm. That's why I feel I should put this video up because usually, you know, when you get that cold shiver, you're like, okay, that's spirits. Okay, so bye.